everybody. I am Veronica Drake. Did that intro get you moving? Do you feel your butt cheeks going on the seat? Listen, everything I do is made to inspire you to raise your energy, to raise your vibration, to open up a heart space that aligns you with the love of the creator. Everything is of love. Now listen, I'm not saying that what you do is right, what I do is wrong, what I do is right, what you do is wrong. I'm saying there are going to be certain people that are just not going to be getting me, nor will I get them, nor should they. I don't shrink heads. I don't boil chicken bones. I don't howl at the moon. I am a very faith-based, God-fearing, fearing meaning I respect and love the energy of God. I am the teacher energy. And I am here with these messages every week that are given to me by the creator to help you expand your center of being. So with that said, if you're in alignment with that, subscribe to my channel because every time I get one of these really cool messages, I'm gonna come right here and then you're gonna get notified and you're gonna get the benefit of love that's gonna come through this video. So, without any further ado, drum roll please, I'd like to bring to you this week's message. Now, I'm always transparent, full disclosure, I sit, I get, I get messages, I write them down, so yes, I'm going to be referring to notes, but also some of it is just going to be given to me off of what I'm reading from the notes that was given to me this morning. Now, today's message is super special because I have two archangels that have come through. Now, the energy of the archangels is very powerful. And so I just want you to take a moment. I want you to really feel your heart space. Just feel the beating of your heart. Take a moment. Breathe, and I want to introduce you to this week's Archangels. They are Metatron, mm, big energy, right? And the other angel is Seraphil, okay? So what you need to know, the theme of this message is all about purification. It's all about releasing the waste, the unnecessary energy that you've been carrying, think of a big hefty bag over your shoulder. There's no more room if you're looking to expand your heart for any of this nonsense anymore. Now, Metatron is helping us to understand how we can better the quality of our life. So wherever you're at, whatever you're going through, just know that it is the stepping stone to what's next. Metatron is right here, and I can feel the power of the angel. I'm going to send that power to you, and you're going to receive it with your mind. And what that simply means is that there is a belief in the angel. And so as you receive it with your mind, I want you to open up to the possibility that he is bringing you the spiritual gifts that God has assigned to you specifically. What you struggle with includes the gift. So if you're struggling in your life and you cannot let go of something, you cannot forgive, what you struggle with is your biggest lesson. And in turn, you will then be the messenger to go teach forgiveness, but first you must do it on your own. And so the angels, the energy of the angels is here to help you do that. Metatron is a huge force and Metatron is reminding you to pay attention to the children around you, the child within, and the behaviors that are childlike. Those three areas are going to bring you deeper into the message. Another part of this message is children are naturally curious and children will naturally try anything because they have no fear base until it's given to them by condition. So what you are to do 
is sit with Metatron and put yourself in the energy and the space of curiosity. And when you get curious, there's no room for frustration. There's only room for patience. So you may sit down and you may try to figure out a situation in your life. You may try to say, how do I empty all of this that's been depleting me? How do I, how do I, how do I? Instead of saying, how do I? You begin to say, how do I accept what is? Now, that's a big pause right there because a lot of you are in the energy of acceptance. You're in the energy of denial. You're in the energy of anger. And you also have a misunderstanding of what acceptance is. And so acceptance is simply allowing to be what is and you move past and on to a new curious phase. Get curious about another way to be. That's how you can incorporate acceptance. The other archangel is Seraphiel. And this is all about purification. And how beautiful of a message when we think childlike behavior and purification. They are like this. They fit together, hands in a glove. Think how pure a child is. Your job should you choose to accept it, is to work with the energy of Seraphil and to put yourself in a space that allows the fire within to burn bright. And what that means is to ignite your passion and get so passionate about whatever it is. For me, it's just life and being alive that it just burns up any other heavy negative energy that's in there. And so I want to tell you that this week will have you questioning everything. Every time you take a turn, you're going to wonder, why is this like this? Why am I doing this? And I'm going to say more so than you typically question things. And the reason is you are being guided to think outside of the box. So forget about every other solution you've tried. It's time to come outside of the box and offer yourself the gift of grace. Be graceful with yourself. Accept all parts of you. Bring yourself to the understanding that as you put this unpure energy, whatever that is for you, into this fire of purification with the archangel Seraphil, that you can release anything inside of you that isn't pure. Now, this is a very heartfelt process. And this is not your traditional message how to uh, go about it like this. This is a very deep message. And those of you that are into quick fixes, you're probably not going to resonate with this message. You're probably not going to listen to this message two or three times like I tell you. But the truth is, those of you that are ready to embrace all parts of you, this could be the catalyst. This could be your aha moment that takes you into the purest, most serene, childlike space that will allow you to create the next phase of your life. Now, I know I'm not for everyone. I don't wanna be for everyone. I'm assigned to the people who resonate with me, who have the same frequency as me, and who are ready to go to the next level with me. If that's you, yay! And if it's not you, I bless you, I wish you well. And here's the thing, it may not just be the right time for us to be together. Who knows? Divine timing is everything. So don't forget to subscribe to this channel. And also, if you want to learn psychic and mediumship development in a non-woo-woo, very practical way, based on theory and understanding the principles and what mediumship and psychic work is, as well as the practical how-tos, you need to check out my school of spiritual arts. It's an online school 
And I'm teaching in there a very simple, practical theory to all of this work. You see, there's nothing evil, there's nothing sinister. Everything is of love. So who knows? Maybe it's time for you to expand your level of awareness. All right, guys, I love you. Have a beautiful, beautiful week.